Welcome to this week's episode of TLA. On this episode, I take a trip north to Bullard's Bar Reservoir to fish kokanee salmon, a type of landlocked salmon that is small but packed with a ton of flavor. These are prized fish for lake and reservoir fishermen. I'm joined on this trip with Muma Outdoors, Fernando, and Tui fishing 24-7. Since this is the first time Tui and I are fishing this reservoir, all the pressure was on Mu to put us on some fish. All the pressure is on Mu. Mu calls this the unskunkable lake, so let's see if we can live up to its name on this week's episode of TLA. I love taking these trips to the mountains. The road trips are filled with fun and camaraderie. The fresh air and solitude of the mountains speak to the soul that is hard to express in words. When I'm up here, the stresses of life just seem to melt away. Me and my friends are happy, and maybe at the end of the day, that's all that really matters. Hey guys, welcome to another episode of TLA. This week, I'm going to a really fun place. Like, would this, would this be considered Sierras? No, that's not Sierras. It's, no, no, no. This is like the north, so. So, this, this is, is north. Like... So, Moose taking me to a place to catch small fish. Up in the mountains. Up in the mountains. Smaller fish. Mountains. High up in the mountains. Anyway, so, uh, it's really chilly today, and you guys know, as much as I know, how I hate fishing in the cold. But, here we are. Every time I go fishing with this guys, we get into drama, and today it's 32 degrees drama which is like whew. frozen bait right here frozen bait he's gonna use me as bait apparently <laughs> and then we got old man twee with his socks look at twee, twee has very interesting socks <laughs> his socks go all the way high like this and he must be very warm very warm in his old man socks Whoa. you see it <laughs> you see, it? You see his old man socks <laughs> all right so we all agree today that no matter what happens, Moo has to put us on fish. Yep. No matter what happens. Yep. So if he has to go down there and swim for a fish, <laughs> he's got to go get us some content because, <laughs> because he owes us content. Yep. He owes us content. Chovy got everybody on herring. Yep. Chovy got everybody on halibut. Yep. Moo got to get everybody on kokanee or we throw him off his boat. Today. They all get ready and we're going to go fishing for kokanee today. Um, very, very excited. I love kokanee fishing. I've only fished for kokanee up in Berryessa, and Berryessa has a great fishery, but this place has a lot of kokanee, so it should be unskunkable. Dude, there's just no fish here. I haven't gotten one bite yet. Who's the pressure on today? Moo! <laughs> yep, Moo. That's why he's out there today. He's working right now. Hold on, let me, let me see if I can find him. He's out there somewhere. Yeah, right there. He's out there. <laughs> If you enjoy these videos and getting some value from it, consider hitting the subscribe button, sharing and liking. It really helps the channel out and allows me to make more quality videos for you. All right guys, so we've been out here for about almost two, three hours and um, I have trolled this place. Left, right, up, down, over, under, Dude, there's just no fish here. I haven't gotten one bite yet. Um, so I'm pretty confused what I should do at this point. Um, Moose says there's there's fish here. I don't believe him. There's a few bites here and there. 
It's tough. I don't know what's up with these fish today. Um, I'm marking them, but they're not biting. So we just got to keep working them, but hopefully uh, they'll turn on at some point in the day. Darn it. Oh, there's a fish that jumped right there. Oh, I finally got one. Holy God. Ah. Whoa! Ah! I finally got one to go after like an hour. Like, God! This is this fish is impossible. Look at this. Oh my God! But I had to catch it on the turn. <laughs> I got a video, baby. I got a video. <laughs> I got content. Come <laughs> on, oh, baby. <laughs> I got a bass! Look at this! I got a bass that has a shad in its mouth. So I got a bass that has another fish in its mouth. You see that? I think that fish might be alive still. Let's see. I'm gonna do some good. I'm gonna let this other fish go if if he's still alive. Come on, buddy. Are you still alive? So this one. Oh my God! A bass that ate another bass. See this? A bass that ate another bass. Oh my goodness! Well, that one is dead. This one is released. Interesting, huh? What do you think about that? The morning started slow, but then eventually the bite started to pick up and everyone started picking up a fish here and there. So it was actually starting to get pretty exciting later on in the day. Drunk is off. Drunk is off. So I had pulled off eight bites and uh Six of them didn't stick, but a two stuck, but I lost them. Finally, got a fish. I don't want to lose it. <laughs> oh, no. oh, I can't, I can't even see it on the video. <laughs> All right, guys, so it's the end of the day. We're heading out back to the launch right now, and uh. It was a mixed day, you know. I mean, I did the worst out of all of everybody. Nando got nine, uh, Moo got four or five, and Tui got like four or five. So, I mean, I think I was doing something just a tad different. Mine was probably a little bit bigger on the hoochie, but um, eh, it is what it is. Some, day, some day is not your day, and some day it is your day. But we are going to head back on land, and we're going to go up and uh, and fry up some food because I'm hungry. Hey! hey! How do you do today? Oh, we did pretty good. Pretty good. Man, first three hours, nothing. Seven and bites. Or eight, yeah, seven bites. And then, the bite kind of picked up. Got this. What? Oh. So cute. So they're, cute. They're so cute. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? So one trick I did learn from catching Kokni at Bullard's is that you definitely need to use smaller hooks and micro hoochies. That definitely makes all the difference up here. Okay, so um, most of us did get fish. I didn't get a fish. I got one fish, which was a lot of fun. I got a bass, but I was happy Tui got his yeah. lot of fish, and he got it at the very end. I know. So he was super happy, so I was super happy that he got his as well. So we're uh, cooking now. We're cooking some fish. So got some good five tip going on here so that's what we have we got some bread and we also got some some salad if you guys enjoy these types of video make sure you like subscribe and share and don't forget to go out to the outdoors like Moose said at our store in beautiful redwood city where we have everything you need to get started our helpful staff will get you situated and answer any questions you may have if you are in the east bay come check out our brand new store in beautiful brooklyn basin
From SUPs to PFDs, our shop has everything you need and our friendly staff will get you situated and in the water in no time. 